we're asked to find the surface area of the cylinder. The surface area of the cylinder is equal to 2 pi r squared plus 2 pi r h, where r is the radius and h is the height. Before we find the surface area though, let's talk about where this formula comes from. If we take the top and bottom off of the cylinder, those would be circles, and then if we cut the side and then roll the side, it would give us a long rectangle as we see here. So here we have the top, the bottom, and the side of the cylinder. Well, we know the area of a circle is equal to pi r squared for both the top and the bottom. And we know the area of a rectangle is equal to length times width. So for this rectangle, this length would be the height of the cylinder. Let's go ahead and label it h. Then this length would be the same length as the circumference of the circle. Remember the circumference of a circle is equal to two pi r, and therefore the length times the width is equal to two pi r times h. So looking back at our surface area formula, two pi r squared gives us the area of the top and bottom, which are circles. And then we have plus two pi r h, which gives us the area of the side of the cylinder, which if we cut the side and enroll it, would be this rectangle here. And now let's find the surface area of the given cylinder. Notice how the radius is equal to six meters and the height is equal to eight meters, which means the surface area of the cylinder is equal to two times pi times r squared is six meters squared plus two times pi times r, which again is six meters, times the height, which is eight meters. Simplifying, six squared is equal to 36, 36 times two is 72, and then we have times pi, which gives us 72 pi, plus two times six is 12, times eight is 96, times pi gives us 96 pi. These are like terms, 72 pi plus 96 pi equals 168 pi, and the units, because it's a surface area, are square meters. So this is the exact surface area of the cylinder. Let's also use our calculator and get our decimal approximation. We enter 168 pi, the pi key is second, and then the exponent key, then we press enter. If you round to two decimal places, notice how there's a seven in the thousandths place value, which means you round up. The surface area is approximately 527.79 square meters. I hope you found this helpful.